my channel. Today I am so excited to be filming two Holy Grail unboxings, both which are Nendroids. I feel like I've been doing so many Nendroid unboxings lately. I don't know why all of a sudden I'm obsessed with Nendroids, but anyways, besides the point, um, two Holy Grail Nendroids here. Y'all, um, I did have this for a while, like a lot of my other figures that I've unboxed. I just haven't found the time to unbox them, but here we are. We are unboxing these two beautiful uh, Nendroids. So the first Nendroid is from the Shoujo romance anime Kimi ni Todoke, and it is of Sawako. And oh my god, y'all, I am so happy I got her at some point. Well, for these two, at some point, I was going to give up on just finding them, but y'all, there's hope. If you haven't found her yet, there is hope. Um, and then I have my other one, which is Kuroki Tomoko from Watamote. You guys know me, you know I love this series. It was one of my first anime series, and I am so happy that I have her. I really want her other... Uh, figures. She has one little Nendroid Petite uh, and then she has this prize figure with an alternate head that comes with her. They are literally um, so expensive. Not as much the Nendroid Petite but this one and the prize figure. Uh, both of these are pre-owned so I'm completely fine with that honestly. They're holy grails. They're hard to find at a good price so as long as they're in good condition, I think they were like new or something like that. It's been a while, so I don't really know. So anyways, let's get to unboxing them. Please make sure you like and subscribe and leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about these guys uh, and if you were able to find them. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so first things first, I think I'm going to go ahead and start with... I think I'm gonna start with Tomoko. Oh, I do not need an X-Acto knife for these because they are pre-owned <laughs> and they're already open. So, oh my god. First off, let me show you the box. So she's an Android 372. She's got different poses. She's even got that pose where she's ripping up the underwear in the bathroom stall. I don't know if you guys remember that freaking scene. Um, and then she's got these guys. And yeah, so I don't know what pose. I'm not gonna show all the poses. These are old Nendroids, so I'm sure there's a review video out there of these guys. So if you want to see how the poses look, I would recommend just finding another video. But this is just me unboxing it and putting, showing you one pose that I'm gonna keep it in. Uh, I do think I'm gonna just put her for now in this uh, pose with her headphones on. Uh, as much as I love this crazy face and this vibrator that she's she thinks is a massage thing, uh, I don't think it would really match my figures. Let's go ahead. Oh my god. Okay. The instructions are still in there and wrapped. Thankfully, just a little folded up. But do we even care? So one thing I was really worried about when purchasing these is that they would come in sticky. Y'all, I'm so glad because I have this Madoka Nendroid up here. She was new though. She was new and she came in very sticky. And I have that um, Ichigo back there and she was pre-owned, but she's really sticky too. And she has like dust on her that like when she came in, she had dust on her, and no matter how much you try to wipe it off, it just doesn't go away, but I, honestly, I'm glad I have her either way, so, because uh, we all know how much she is if you're a Tokyo Mew Mew fan. But, oh my god, you guys, oh my god, look how freaking precious, ah! I freaking love Tomoko. The only other item I have of to Tomoko is a, um acrylic stand which I will show you guys let me where is it it's down here this is how it looks uh this is based off the manga's art style and I think she's super cute um here are her beats headphones the logo 
I will do a b-roll for this as well uh, so you just you just you just pop it on there's no like tag or anything but look at her listening to her music so cute she's so cute I love her so much y'all <laughs> <laughs> oh, I should put her backpack on. She does come with her backpack. All right, y'all. I have her in the pose I want to keep her in. I think this is the wrong arm, to be honest, but I didn't change it. So I'll change it later. But this is basically the um, pose I want her in. It's cute and simple. I do have her backpack on. Uh, it, there's a peg on her backpack where it sticks to the back of her back, the, the hole in her back. Uh, and then there's a hole here for the actual stand. Um, super cute, I love her so much. Um, again, I will show a B-roll somewhere here. That is Tomoko. I'm so grateful that I have her. Oh, I love her so much. Okay, moving on. We will be moving on now to Sawako. Let's see. So I'll show you the box. So the, this is the box, really cute box, honestly. Uh, she has her cute little smile here. I think, honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna put her with the dog. I forgot what the dog's name was, I'm sorry. But I am gonna put her with the dog and then I think, I don't know, I think, I think I'm gonna put her in this pose. I just love the way her eyes sparkle in the show when she's like smiling and oh God, it's just so freaking adorable and so beautiful. So I think that's the pose I wanna keep her in. So here we go. Oh, and she is Dendroid 179 if anybody cares. <laughs> Okay, so she looks like she's in better condition and came um, in better packaging, or she came packaged better than Tomoko did. Tomoko kind of had all her parts all around the box. Um, this seller put her all together um, like new. Oh, there's a little dirt on the base. That's okay. Okay, I'll clean that up later. But small base, y'all. Give it up for the small bases. The small bases. I love the small bases. Okay, anyways. <laughs> um, and then we have Sawako. She looks perfect. She looks great. Oh my God. I love her hair so much. Oh my God, she's so freaking cute. Look at her. Oh my God. Okay. Um, and then here's the little doggy. Ah, look how cute he is, he's blushing. Oh, but you know what? I do love the small base, but I hate these stands where like they're just held up by their legs. It, I have Yui on that and like, sh it's so hard to balance her. I freaking hate it. But anyways, small base, yay. <laughs> So I'm gonna go ahead and put her together. She does have a little bit like scrapes on here, but like you can't really tell at all. But okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put her together and I will be right back. All right, so here she is. Oh my God, she's so cute. Look at her eyes, y'all. She's so beautiful. I really wish they made Kazehaya with her. I think oh, that would have been such a cute duo. And then of course she will be with her little dog. It was so hard not to unbox these two Nendroids the day I had them shipped 
to my house. I have been waiting so long to unbox them and I just never got to it because I've got other figures that had come in and that were newer. I'm just rambling now. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that if you're looking for these two Nendroids that you, or either one of them, I hope that you find them as well. Don't give up your search. You will find them for a good price. And yeah, I will see you in the next video, which is hopefully, hopefully soon. Bye-bye guys.